Gyro stabilization for the Blackmagic Pocket 6K Pro. Does it work? I recently shot some test footage with the Pocket 6K Pro. I wanted to see if I could get usable footage using a lens without built-in stabilization. All shot handheld. Unfortunately, it was shaky and not pretty. That's because the Pocket 6K Pro doesn't have built-in camera stabilization, but it does record gyro information that you can use in Resolve to smooth out camera movement. All you need to do is have the latest version of camera software and a recent version of DaVinci Resolve. Let me show you. So we're in Resolve. I'll go to the Edit tab at the bottom of the screen. Then I'll click on a clip that I want to stabilize. Then at the top right hand side of the screen, I'll click Inspector. Then I'll scroll down to Stabilization. Under Mode, I'll select Camera Gyro. I'll leave the strength at 1. Then I'll click Stabilize. It stabilizes the clip pretty quickly. You might have noticed the clip zoomed in a little bit. That's so we can't see the edges of the shot move around as Resolve moves the image around to smooth it out by counteracting the bad movement. By zooming in, the stabilization movement is hidden. That's it. So let's take a look at a bunch of shots I quickly color corrected and stabilized. You'll see the shot as it was shot with no stabilization. Then you'll see it repeat again with stabilization. It really fixed a lot of the footage. It does a fantastic job, in my opinion, on static shots and on simple moves. It can't perform miracles, though. It's not like using a gimbal, which is completely understandable. By the way, shoot with higher shutter speeds to reduce motion blur. This will give you better results. Don't worry, you can add motion blur and resolve. Simply go to the Color tab. Then click Effects on the top right of the screen. Then hit the search icon and type Motion Blur. Select it and drag it onto the clip's node. I'll change the type to Better and put the motion range on Medium. For the Motion Blur level, I'll try 24.8. Experiment with these settings until you get a natural look. Well, I hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe.